A driver is sharing his story tonight after his car was shot at, shot at while driving down a local highway. He says he heard a loud bang, then spotted the bullet hole. Westmoreland County Bureau Chief Ross Gadotti spoke with the victim and joins us live with more. Ross. Talking to Terry Steiner earlier today along 22 and he thought maybe a truck kicked up a very very big rock and then he got home and realized what hit him certainly wasn't a rock terry steiner's 2001 jet black ford ranger is his pride and joy it's never seen rain or anything you know, he has, it's seven years old with 12,000 miles that's just it's a limited use truck it's perfect except for this Big hole in the side of the truck, and I know it's a bullet hole. I've been around with guns. A dangerous blemish created as Steiner apparently was rolling along Route 22 eastbound near Johnette Road on Sunday afternoon. And I heard a hard impact on the truck, loud. But it was louder than that. It was heavy, heavy. I think somebody punched the side of the truck. Steiner says being a Sunday, no hunters should have been in the woods. And if they were sighting in their rifles, they forgot the number one rule. You got you to know where the bullet stops. You have to know where the bullet stops. In this case, it was the side of Steiner's truck. We believe it was most likely an accident. Nevertheless, state police say if they're able to figure out just who pulled the trigger, that individual is in trouble. Although it could have been an accident, the one thing that falls in the Pennsylvania Crimes Code is recklessly endangering the welfare of a person. Meanwhile, Steiner says he's going to get his truck patched up, and Steiner is a veteran hunter and firearms expert knows he's a very lucky man. It could have hit any, anybody or anything. Thank God it didn't hit me in the head. And yes, while state police do believe this to have been an accident, they want to know if anybody else may have had a close uh, call with a round potentially hitting their car on Sunday or over the weekend on Route 22. And if so, please contact them. Reporting live, Ross Gadotti, KDKA TV News.